Welcome to the November 2024 Grow Omaha Construction Update, proudly sponsored by Leader Construction. We'll get to the Leader Construction Featured Project of the Month in just a few minutes, but first, let's take a look at some of these other projects. This month we start off at the Tenasca Center for Arts Engagement at the Holland Performing Arts Center. Last time we were here, they were just starting to put the finishes on the first floor. Now you can see there is finishes all the way up to the top of the building. Up next is the Mutual of Omaha Tower, where crews are getting to the last floor or 15th floor of the parking garage. Meanwhile, the core is now up to 24 stories in the air. We've been told that the goal for the Mutual of Omaha Tower is to complete about 20 floors a year. Right behind the Mutual of Omaha Tower, or just to the west of it, Work is continuing on the duo apartments where the duo twin towers are being connected in the middle. Crews are also working on the top two floors which were previously mechanical rooms and they're also replacing all the windows in the building. When complete, this building will contain 700 apartment units. A new project we haven't covered on the Grow Omaha Construction Update before is the 15th and Marcy Apartments. This will contain 82 units, which will be four floors above an underground parking structure. Just to the east are the Boho Flats on 13th and Pierce Street. Work has continued on this building all summer long and brick is going up and also the exterior windows are being installed. Now it's time to check out this month's Leader Construction Featured Project of the Month. This month we are checking out the Salvation Army North Corps at 24th and Pratt Street. The North Corps is undergoing a $15 million renovation and expansion. When complete, the North Corps will include a large worship area, which will also double as community space. The building will feature high-tech classrooms for after-school programs and adult education. The Salvation Army's North Corps will also include a brand new gymnasium that will be twice the size of the gymnasium they have now. The building will also include a large commercial kitchen. Work on this project should wrap up in 2026. Also happening in North Omaha is the Forever North development at 24th and Lake. This is a mixed use project with a few different four story buildings. One building will be 80,000 square feet of office, 15,000 square feet of retail, and a 4,000 square foot daycare, and will be home to North End Teleservices. Also happening in the other buildings will be 99 apartment units. Next, we head out to Midtown and check out the core building on the UNMC campus. This six-story building will be 180,000 square feet and should be ready in 2026. The building will handle UNMC's administrative functions. We make our way out to Northwest Omaha, and there's a former 24-hour fitness, which was gutted and added onto and will now be home to 160 apartment units. The complex will also feature a pool and indoor and outdoor parking. A new retail building is going up at 156 in Maple. We believe this building will be home to Williamsburg Pizza and Stories Coffee.
Down in Papillion, the first building has gone vertical in the Tower District. This first building will be home to a Starbucks, but we believe there will be several announcements coming up in the very near future for other businesses in the development. We jump back out to Northwest Omaha. We're at 168th and Maple, just a couple blocks to the south. Groundwork is underway for a new Popeyes. We head west to 180th and Maple, where a Green State Credit Union is under construction. This is an Iowa City-based bank that has 30 branches in Iowa and Illinois, and this will be the first branch in Nebraska. Now let's head over to 72nd and Dodge and check out Omaha's new main library. Over the last few weeks, work has begun on the unique exterior of the building. We zip down 72nd Street to 71st and Mercy Road, where the new apartment building has gone vertical. In the past, we showed you construction of the parking garage, but now the wood framing for the actual apartment has gone up. And since I've recorded this, they've added a couple more floors to the building. Time to hop in the helicopter and check out the new St. Patrick's Catholic Church at Maple Street and Big Elk Parkway. Big Elk Parkway is about 186th Street. When I was up in the helicopter that day, I also swung by the River's Edge Park on the western end of Council Bluffs. Here, the crews from Leader Construction are working on the Mid-America Adventure Tower. When complete, this tower will be 138 feet tall. Well, thanks for tuning in to this month's Grow Omaha Construction Update, sponsored by Leader Construction. As always, if you have any questions or comments, please feel free to send an email to news at growomaha.com. We thank you for tuning in again this month, and we'll see you again next time.